Hello everybody, welcome back to Steve's Gear. And today we're going to look at a few more Zippo items. So just a couple of videos ago, I got my first Zippo, which was this matte black one here. Um, I got the little kit that came with the fluid and the extra flints. And I thought, you know, I'd kind of like to have maybe one of the butane inserts. So I got on Amazon and kind of looked around and I found a few things that were on sale. So I got a new Zippo that was on sale, and then I bought this Butane Insert Gift Kit, which was on sale. So this one is the Dual Flame Insert. I was kind of hoping to get the Single Flame, but this one I think was, I want to say this was on sale for $15 for this kit. And I think the Zippo I got for around the same price. I think it was like $15. So, um... Yeah, we'll kind of open them up and take a peek, and we'll put it together and see how it works. So first, we'll take a look at the Zippo. Um, this one isn't anything, you know, super fancy, but I got it because I thought it might not be a bad one to take out. So a little bit better of an unboxing experience with this one not coming in the kit. I mean, this one comes in an actual box. Um, so that's pretty cool. And for this one, I got one in orange. So this one's branded with the, the Zippo name. Um, I thought orange would be kind of handy, you know, I go out in the woods or, you know, go out, go camping or something. And it might be easier to find with uh, being that's orange in case I drop it or something. I've been known to go out and go fishing and maybe have a couple too many beers. When I go back to camp, I've sometimes misplaced things and I thought, well, Brian Owen's Zippo might kind of help. So we'll kind of set that to the side and we'll open up this butane kit. Um, yeah, they had a couple different kind of gift sets on there that were on sale. Um, I, I mean, this is only the second time I've ever shot for Zippo, so I don't know if it's something that's like that all the time. Um, this one just comes with like a little, just a little can of uh, butane and it comes with the insert and this is probably just the instructions some safety warnings things like that I should probably read them but we'll wing it for now all right so my first one I know that you can pull this out I'll pop this thing out here real quick we won't fill it up with any fluids. We'll set that one aside. And then this one should just go right into it. Actually, we'll fill it up first. So, yeah, we'll fill it up. I did watch a video of this online, so it didn't look like it was anything super crazy. It looks like you just insert it in there and it has a little adjustment. So it looks like that right there would be your fill hole, and then that's your adjustment for your flame. So we'll fill it up. Um, has the double jets in there. Like I said, I was kind of hoping to get the single one, um, but I mean the dual one will work just fine. But the only thing I'll probably use this for is maybe lighten some, you know, some. Oops. Well, maybe I'm doing something wrong here. Um. You know, I'll probably use it for like lighting some fire starters or little things like that. You know, I'm not going to do anything super crazy. Like I said, I don't smoke or anything. So it'll mostly be just for, you know, starting campfires or lighting a grill or something. Um, I don't really know how much to put in there. I didn't really, I guess I could have read the instructions for how long, how long I'm supposed to put it in there for. But I did have a little bit leak out there. That should be enough to get it started. Um, we'll kind of let it, it's cold when it comes out. It's almost like freezing. So we'll kind of let it sit rest for a second. Nothing's leaking out of it or nothing. It's pretty much all evaporated. And then it should just insert right in there.
Is the work just fine? There we go. Just took a second for it to get some fluid, I think, in there. But yeah, seems to work just fine. I don't really think I'll need to adjust the flame height on it. Probably works just fine for me. I've also been traveling for work, so this package has actually been sitting outside for, oh, pretty much a day. So I just pulled it in, so it's pretty darn cold. I think it got all the way up to like 15 degrees here today, so it's kind of like a heat wave. Yeah, it seems to be working great now. Yeah, we'll kind of keep it filled up. Um, I think these are, yeah, they're exactly the same. No difference in size. Um, this one's kind of got the orange bottom. This one's more of a kind of a brass looking. But, well, I went from having zero to now having two. So I got the one with the lighter fluid. Still works great. Um, still lights first time. Um, I've heard a couple people mention that they kind of evaporate quickly, so something to kind of keep an eye out if you have to fill it up, if it sits for a long time. If I was to take it out camping, maybe to check the fluid level, top it off. I think the butane, uh, I don't think you have that problem with the butane. I think it stays pretty much in there. Um, I said I'll probably top it off here and there, but I feel like the... I don't know what the technical name for it is. There's probably a name for the click, but I feel like it's a lot more... A lot stronger with the butane insert but yeah just kind of a quick silly video kind of just showing you guys then that's the original one that came out of it I'll just leave this as kind of like a backup I won't put any fluid or anything in it but it looks to be the exact same size everything fits fine but yeah it seems to be working great now must just took a minute for that fluid to get in there yeah I think it'll be kind of nice for going out um, I've mentioned a few times in my previous videos that I use those firebox stoves. So I'm always kind of lighting a fire starter or lighting some, you know, tinder or something. So, um, it'd be kind of nice to use one of these. Something new. Might save me from buying some Bix this summer because I always seem to lose them. Hopefully I won't lose these. But, yeah, that's all I got for you today. So if you're interested, they do have that kit. I don't know if it's still, it should still be on sale. I just ordered it a couple days ago. Um, yeah, I think it was 15 bucks for the butane kit, and then I think the lighter was $15 as well. So I could have got one, the matte black one, for a little bit less money, but I chose just to get the orange one just because of the fact that maybe I won't lose it. <laughs> all right, guys, that's all I got for you today. Thanks for watching. Hope you all have a good day.